thank you very much, uh, Senator Schumer. Um, all of us were home in our states last week, and I think we all had a common experience. In Connecticut, the level of anxiety and fear and unrest from parents and kids that I talked to has no precedent. Um, parents and kids are really worried about their safety. And they're equally worried that the adults who run the country aren't serious about protecting our communities and our schools. This, to me, feels like a moment where doing nothing is simply not an option. Now, we have to pass legislation that saves lives. None of us should be interested in just checking a box. But I'm encouraged by the discussions that we have had with Republicans over the course of the last week and a half. Every day we get closer to an agreement, not further away. I'm grateful to all of the members of our caucus who have pitched into these discussions, and I'm grateful to Senator Schumer for giving us the space that we need to land an agreement. Um, obviously, an agreement that we reach with the Republicans won't come close to the full list of things I think are necessary to curb this epidemic. But the American people are looking for progress right now. They're looking for action. And my hope is in the coming days we'll be able to come together in a way that gets us 60 uh, plus votes. Um, remember, there's no other country in the world in which our kids fear for their lives when they go to school. Um, my passion for this issue is not coincidental to the fact that I have a fourth grader, same age as those kids in Uvalde. And my fourth grader should not have had to go to school the day after Uvalde and have the conversations with his classmates that he did about where they would run, where they would hide if the same thing happened to them. Only in America do those conversations happen. And my belief is that Republicans are engaged sincerely in these discussions. And my hope is that we will be able to have a compromised product that saves lives uh, on the table for our colleagues to consider uh, very shortly. And again, I'm very grateful to all of the members of our caucus that have supported us in these efforts. Thanks, Senator Schumer. Senator Murphy. Thank you. Senator Durbin.